Hi, it's Carter Hellman, and hi, it's Tucker Hellman, and welcome to Curling Chronicles, Paying It Forward, where we get tips and advice from top curlers. Today, we're here with our coach, Annie McDonald. Let's see what she has to say. Hi, guys. Hi, Annie. Thank you so much for talking to us today. Of course. Hi, my name is Andy McDonald. I'm here at the Coyotes Curling Club to talk a little bit about my curling experiences. I've been curling for 10, 11 years now. I've been to six junior national championships, one mixed doubles championship, and I'll be going to mixed nationals in April where I'll be skipping a team. My family and I moved to Madison, Wisconsin for my dad's curling career, Patrick McDonald. He curled on Team USA uh, and that's how I kind of got into curling. There's not much to do because there's snowing all the time. Um, and I went to his competitions and that's kind of how I picked it up. He coached me when I was playing juniors um, and I went to many competitions. Learning how to curl in Madison really helped my curling career move along, learning from the best there. And then we moved to Phoenix, Arizona, where I represented Mopac for two years in juniors, and I'm still curling here at the Coyotes Curling Club. My tips for junior curlers would definitely be to play as much as you can and losing is okay. Losing helps you learn more and helps you understand the game better. Um, another tip I would give junior curlers is to meet all, all the people, meet everybody. Um, everyone else can teach you a lot about what they have learned and understanding kind of how other people curl is also important. I transitioned into coaching recently and it has been an eye-opening experience to kind of see the different perspectives that coaches have and I definitely have learned a lot and it has made my curling career more valuable. <laughs>